Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome to Colima in Let's Play Golden Sun. As you can see, everyone are our people again. Yay! So let's talk to some of them. This village is Colima, village of lumberjacks. I'll shout it out loud! <laughs> and I believe this is simply, yep, that's what I thought. Who would try to use the holy tree to build a palace anyway? Who indeed? Mm, excuse me. I've been a lumberjack for years, but I'll never see anything like this. I think I'll go home to my family in a mill. I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay with that. Oh, that's just great. I'm only a merchant, but I got turned into a tree just for staying here! I think I'll head to Zion, south of the river, now that I'm a mannequin. Or, I think that's Zion anyway. It might be like. Let me think. It should be more like Zion, but. close enough. Trees are so sleepy. I turned into a tree right when the sparkles fell from the sky. Anyway, we are of course here for this. Uh, well more than just this, but actually, I don't even know if they have a... Uh, well... Yeah, they do have some new stuff actually. I really wish I hadn't bought uh, those hats now. Also, that's what I thought. Um, this is plus seven and eight. This is plus five and six. Wait, what? That can't be right. I know for a fact that Isaac has better defense than Garrett, so why is this a better boost on Garrett? I don't know. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Uh, we can actually afford, I think, all of these? Uh, maybe. We can afford most of them. No new weapons, and, um, actually, wait. You have the broadsword. However, that's not a massive attack increase, so it's not worth buying. I would rather buy defense than attack, and honestly, um, I'm not even gonna bother with the helmets, to be honest. I want the armlet for the- actually, I don't even think I need that on Maya. She has a- f her defense isn't super high, but it's high enough. Mostly, I just want to increase Mr. Glass Cannon Ivan here. Because he just dies way too quickly. He needs all the defensive items he can get. I heard that the traveling warriors up from the Goma range saved the village! Uh... Uh, well... I am very... They, I don't know about enormously huge, but they are definitely very strong. Yeah, yeah, I, I think they did t re defeat Trent at that. S or something like that, anyway. Big, strong warriors with great beards freed Kolima from the curse. Beards. Not for another 30 years. Oi. All warriors are big and all warriors have huge beards. I, I don't know how to feel about that. Dad, will you please go back to being a lumberjack? Dad, how are you, we going to eat if you don't work? I'm never going to use an axe again. People turn into trees because of my axe. I will never use an axe again. Uh, well, I don't know how responsible it is to do so at the expense of your, of your children. Uh, I say children because I assume this is his daughter since she referred to him as dad. Uh, but at the same time, it is commendable of you to take responsibility for your actions. <laughs> anyway. Anyway. 
still a few more places to check. Uh, yeah. I don't know if I'd say anyone, but Daddy told me his secret. You saved Coloma? Wow, that makes me want to tell you a secret. But I'm not gonna. It's too good to give away. Hidden in, hidden deep in the forest. But I can't tell him that. What? I don't even know what he's talking about. I really don't. Uh-huh. Oh, he told the kid though, didn't he? Still, telling me he's outside the village doesn't help much. Neither does deep in the forest, to be honest. You know, being a tree gives you a lot of time to think. I'll bet. Are you the one? No. Barnacles. Oh well. Oh well. We rely on the forest so much and yet we hurt the sacred tree. Maybe we can work to restore harmony in the forest now. And we're pretty much done here. But we are not heading east. And that because you need to go east to get Yeah. We're not going that way yet. We have other stuff to do. Stuff like visiting the town over here. Oh, and also visiting the people that were at the barricade. Hey, you're that guy! Jill, are these the people who saved you? Remember me? I was that tree. I would have been swept down river if, you, if it wasn't for you. Please, take this. It's a small token of my appreciation. Well, you got a hard nut! Yay! I will never forget what you've done for me. Thank you so much. There, you see? Totally worth saving the tree. Uh, yeah. No kidding. Not only did we end up saving a woman, um... <laughs> Which, you know, reward in itself, I guess. Uh, you know, I should really give this to Maya. I suppose. Because Ivan has too much shit in his inventory still. Actually, no. I should give this to Maya. Uh, I should give this back to Ivan. And I should use the hard nut on Ivan. I would actually probably get more bank from Buck if I used this on, say, Isaac. But... The fact of the matter is, Ivan needs it the most. He has the best equipment, and he still has the lowest defense. Well, actually, to be fair, I... Uh, Isaac probably has slight... Oh, hey, it's open now. Isaac probably has slightly better equipment, but... Still. Wait, really? Man, that's just weirding me out now. Just anyway. Anyway, I was turned into a tree for a while. Can you believe it? Yes. I think I know now what it means to sink your roots into one place. But I wouldn't recommend it to anyone else. I, I should think not. You're wondering about the... Uh-huh. Anyway, we actually want to do just one thing here. Excuse me. Oh, it's... Oh, sir! We've been looking everywhere for you! The curse of the holy tree. You're the ones who broke it, right? Of course. What? What do you mean I'm under arrest? What is going on? So ye the we I mean brave lads who saved Kulima. What are your names then? He's Isaac, sir, and I'm Garrett. I'm called Ivan. And I am Maya from the village of, of Emil. Isaac and Company. 
Ah, ye know the ones who entered the course of the Holy Tree! I don't know what's going on with this. I humbly thank you. I mean my voice. I know what's going on with him. Um, okay. That's kind of odd that you arrested us first, but... Um, I was mighty worried about... He may not stop here on your way back. Eh. Speaking hard. I want to show my appreciation for your help. I relied on my money, but I forgot about my people's needs. He reminded me of my duties. As lord of these lands, I will do my best for everyone's behalf. Isaac. It would honor me greatly if ye'd accept a wee token of my gratitude. I could give it to you here, but would you no rather choose it yourself? Uh, yes? Very well. You can choose something that'll help you along your way. I will show Isaac and his friends the way, my lord. Many thanks to ye. And to your companions as well. Visit me anytime, and you'll always find a warm heart here. From you, at least. I don't know about your wife. Follow me, and I'll take you to the treasure room. Now, unless I misremember, what happens here is we get to choose one box. Lord McCoy has ordered that Isaac and his companions to be brought here. Please show them their reward! Yeah, we can choose a single one. So I'm gonna save here because I don't remember what's in any of these. Uh. You see, I don't freaking want a vial. Uh, so. I am going to reload. Reloaded! Okay, a potion is is strictly better than a vial, but I think we can do better. Uh, Psy Crystal is much more valuable than even a potion, I think. The Psy Crystal might be the best one to take, but I don't remember what's in the last box. So, let's look. Water- nope, that's definitely the best one. Um, <laughs> yeah. Water of Life is... The single rarest and most valuable consumable in the game. And I mean valuable more than just hoarding wise, but. Oh, hey, do I have another hard nut? <laughs> I do! Wow, okay. If I gave this to Ivan, he would actually almost be even with Maya. Uh, sure, why not? I say almost, because keep in mind, Ivan has better defensive items than Maya. Okay then. Okay then. Do I have any other of those while I'm at it? I do not. But yeah, as I was saying, water not only are they the most valuable from a usefulness point of view, but they sell for the most by a fairly significant margin. Nope. Okay, wait, can I no. Well, clearly he has finished his mansion. Uh, for south of Goma range, black clouds are... Okay, then. Now, I think there's something in one of these. I just need to find it. Oh, really? A smoke bomb? That is just the worst. I need to sell that, too. That's basically the same as the sleep bomb, except it's delusion, I believe, instead of sleep. And it's definitely something I'm going to sell, because they're, those things are freaking useless. Uh, it, well... There's a sheet of paper titled, Sweetie's Gifts. It's a list of the gifts M Lord McCoy has bought his wife. It's pretty long. <laughs> he clearly spoils his wife in extremely. Milady was very upset when she left the room. Oh my. 
for once, my lord didn't let Lady McCoy push him around. He seems much more dashing now. Tee hee. Huh? Oh, for a second, I thought you were my lady. You really startled me. Silk negligee. <laughs> That's great. People of Billabin will never forget your bravery. Okay, I think this is the room Lord McCoy was in. Yep. Can I check the flower pots? Nope. Okay. I guess I'll. Uh. Okay. Okay then. May as well check the rest of the things, although I don't think there's any more hidden stuff. I was watching from here. After all that fuss, you still went to Coloma? Yep. I don't know how you removed the curse, but you're the best. Damn straight. But yeah, I don't think there's any other... No, I already checked that one. Hidden items, but... It really doesn't hurt to be thorough. Especially in this game. Oh hey, what do you know, it's an elixir. That's not really any more useful than the sleep or than the uh smoke bomb, but hey, what what whatever. I heard you received a spectacular reward. I hope that shows you how nice Mi Lord McCoy really can be. Quite a set palace construction was halted. Oh lady. Oh, I definitely want to go rub salt in the wound. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, there's an old guy. You are a fine warrior. Thank you. Sometimes we need children to remind us of our own responsibilities. Isn't that just the truth? Um, sometimes you really just need... I wouldn't even go as far as to say it doesn't even need to be a child. Sometimes you just need someone in general to remind you. Anyway, let's go, uh, actually, wait. No? Okay, let's go rub salt in the wound. Hmm, my palace is not finished. McCoy loves that holy tree more than he loves me. What a bitch. Just trying to what? Not only are in fact, it's worse than just that. Not only are you a self-obsessed asshole, but you're an idiot, man. What an idiot! It just amazes me, is what it does. Anyway, anyway, we are done here. So let's go to our next destination. Uh, right after I go to the inn. Right here. 28 coins is chump change, essentially. So, yeah. Now, spoiler alert, the next destination, we are still not going east. We have one more stop to make, because now that we have Maya, there's something else we can do that we could not do before. So, without further ado, I will meet you there. And here we are in Vault, where we will promptly leave immediately because this is not where we're actually going. We still can't get that Ginny, unfortunately. However, what we can do is walk up here and remember this place where Ivan's Lord got kidnapped, essentially, locked up, and there was this, with, with the gate we could not get past. Well, well, I believe I said this a while ago, but, but, it's time to show you what this does. It attacks a frigid blast, but it does more than that too. It also can freeze things out in the field, things like puddles of water, and what turns into ooh, a puddle of water? when it's heated up? Kind of 
Conspicuously large ice pillars is what. So now we can enter the City of Thieves, Loonpa. Uh, yes? Hmm, your face doesn't ring a bell. I guess you don't really stand out. Yes, let's go with that. I doubt anyone can enter Loompa now with all the tight security. And, okay, this is just the Sanctum. Uh, oh. Huh. Remember this for later. But, we're gonna be going over here. Yes. Dumpa's in the fortress. You have to go there if you want to see him. But it's very... Wait, what was that? But it has very tight security. Nothing. Oh, that's not even a thing. Do you have anything? Nope. Okay, well, as long as I'm here, let's sell this garbage. Okay, then. And we still have the empty bottle. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna keep that, because just as a uh, trophy. But we don't actually need this anymore, I don't think. There might be something later on where it comes in handy, but not nothing that I can think of, so... If nothing else, you can sell it for a quick buck. Dump has no idea what Dadampa is doing. This village would change if Dumpa heard about Dadumpa's evil deeds. You don't say. Move, please. I want to... whatever. The sound of frogs from inside? Eh. Nothing? Nothing. Okay. My late grandfather traveled the continent with Lunpa. He would be very sad to see the th things Dadumpa are doing now. We live in Loompa, but we'll never work for Dodompa. I'm sort of proud of myself that I can say that name consistently. Because it's the sort of name where it's not really hard to say on the surface, but that I would trip over. Due because of the repeated sound, uh, the chief from the inn has been delivering meals to the fortress lately. He says security is very tight, even inside the fortress. Really? Dadampa made it a pretty penny for himself at capturing Hammett. But he doesn't care about what happens to us villagers at all! Uh, not right now, actually. Yes, I do. I was blindfolded and guided along a cool path. I walked for a while. I heard my footsteps echoing, so it must have been an underground path. I feel bad for that poor man they've got locked in the dungeon. It doesn't matter how much we clean or wait for customers, no one will come. Aww. Hey, no. There we go. Nothing. Nothing! Oh hey, actually forget about remembering that shape, remember this shape. Um. Or this spot, anyway. Actually, maybe remember both of them, because I don't remember if there's anything in the top one now. But, anyway. Is it true that Dodompa kidnapped Hammond and extorted ransom from him? Yes. Then I guess Dodompa's men were telling the truth. Dodompa is too- or Dodompa is too old to lead, so his men do whatever Dodompa says. Indeed. What? Oh, I can't. Okay. No, I don't want to talk to you! Ow, screw you. Ooh, there's definitely some stuff in here. What exactly, I'm not sure, but stuff. You know, stuff. Uh, yeah. Anyway. Oh, hey, a vial. That's actually super valuable. Anything else in here? There might be one more thing. I'm not sure, so let's just check. 
really quickly. Uh, no. Okay then. Give that to whoever's holding them. Garrett, I suppose. Garrett has way too many healing items, it's just unnatural. <laughs> no freedom ever since the caravan came. Okay. Anyway. Wait, you're closed? Ah, uh, that's lame. But I guess understandable. The item shop's probably open. Oh, yeah, wait, no, I already went there, didn't I? Lumpa was caught in a great flood while traveling with someone named Babby. Babby, you say? I wonder, I wonder if that will come up later on. Well, I, I don't know how it could, since Lupa is like, he's dead. Um, he was, Lupa's son is ancient, so. Lupa passed away long ago, but the world was hit with, but with a huge flood. Lupa had gone south, and he was never seen again after the flood. Anyway, anyway, um... Let's just try this, I guess. Uh, wait. We totally can't get in here, can we? <laughs> Oi. We can't! Awesome, I came here too soon. Uh, how do I get up there, though? I feel like I can do that. Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see across there, so I would need to get up here somehow, but how? Man, I actually thought I could do this now. Well, no, saying that is not strictly true. I, c I couldn't remember whether or not I could do this now. I knew I could get in, but... I suspected I may need have needed something to complete the this area, but I couldn't actually remember for sure without actually coming here, so can I no. Well I'll have to leave the long way, but now we're done here because we can't actually do anything else here right now. So join me next time when we travel east to and then south and across the river and it's it'll be evil forest time. It it, it it's kind of You'll see. But until then, this has been Let's Play Golden Sun with Cast Blue, and have a nice day.